So just like the thumbnail says, this may be the future of the white cane. Stick around and we'll find out. And stay tuned to the end of the video to find out how you can get one of these for free. Hey guys, it's Sam with The Blind Life and this is the No Jab Cane. It's a revolutionary new style of white cane which promises to alleviate both wrist strain and those annoying jabs to the gut. <laughs> this cane was developed by a guy named John who after using a standard traditional white cane for a while, he was frustrated by constantly getting jabbed in the stomach while he was walking using his cane. Every time he would bump into something, the cane would jab him right into the stomach. And he thought, there's gotta be a better way. So after several years of development, countless prototypes, lots and lots of money, he created the No Jab Cane. And when you first look at it, it just looks like a standard white cane, what we're all familiar with. Albeit a little bit fancier one, has full red leather handle, leather wrapped handle. But other than that, you know, just your standard white cane. But it's actually much, much more than that. And in fact, the whole genius behind the no jab cane is in the handle here and how it compresses as the cane comes into contact with obstacles. So what John very brilliantly did is to place a spring in the handle which allows it to compress and absorb the shock of the impact. So that's the really cool feature of the cane, but we'll come back to that. Let's talk about some of the other aspects of it first. Number one, it's made from a 50-50 blend of both carbon fiber and fiberglass. And then even the joints here the metal connectors in the joints are all made out of aluminum. So it's a relatively light cane. It's not heavy at all. Super light, but really strong and durable. Now, if you've ever had a cane break on you, you know it's usually the cord breaking and causing the cane to just fall apart. Well, they have fixed that problem also by using this super, super strong cord here. It's called Sergeant Knots, and it's a marine grade Dacron polyester blend. Super, super strong. This one just has a small marshmallow tip. But the great thing is these canes are compatible with Ambutech tips. So whatever tips you want, you can put on here and they're going to work great. Now the handle. The handle is pretty awesome. As I mentioned before, it's wrapped with genuine leather and it's dyed red, has stitching along one side. Just really, really high quality. It's the golf club style handle. Even has these little rubber accents at the top and the bottom of the handle, which adds a little bit of extra style to it. Separates it from just your standard white cane. The loop of cord at the top that you could wrap around your wrist also has an adjustable clasp here so you can change the size of the loop. And I like that. I've never fully understood just tying a knot in the strap here to make the loop. I've always thought an adjustable clasp just makes more sense. So it's nice to see it standard on this cane. Something else to mention about the grip is you've got a 10 and a half inch grip here, which gives you a lot of real estate to hold on. It also allows you to choke up on the grip, letting the cane rest underneath your forearm, which gives you a lot more control as you're walking, further reducing the strain on the wrist. Now let's talk about probably the coolest feature of the no jab cane is the compression handle here, the spring loaded handle. When it compresses down, you've got about five or six inches of movement, which means as you run into an obstacle, that's reducing a lot of the impact strain on your wrist. And the creators of the cane have actually tested it and they say about 80% of that impact is reduced. I've shown the cane to some of my colleagues and 100% across the board, everybody really liked the cane. Everybody said that it, it felt like a very well-made, sturdy cane. Everybody reported that the cane provided really good feedback for identifying objects. And even though the handle floats along the shaft here at the top, it doesn't affect the way that the cane performs or how well it detects the obstacles in front of you. So all in all, I really like the cane. It's not all 100% positive though. I do have a couple very, very tiny 
gripes, tiny issues with the cane. Uh, number one, I would love the wrist strap to be a little bit longer. When you fold up your cane and you go to wrap the strap around the cane to keep it nice and tightly closed, you have to go from the bottom. And I have always preferred to pull the strap up and go over the top. That's just me, it's just a personal preference. But as it is, the wrist strap is not long enough to go over the top. You have to go from the bottom. Not a big deal, but just one of those things. The only other minor issue that I have is the noise of the spring, the sound of the spring. You know, it's <laughs> sounds like an old bed. <laughs> Once again, not a big deal, uh, but other people mention that as well, that the spring is a little loud. I don't know if you could shoot some WD-40 up in there. <laughs> Probably not, but... Um, once again, if I had to pick out a couple little things, that might be one of them. Other than that, I have no problems with the cane. It performs really, really well, folds up nicely. The cane deploys perfectly, no problems, locks into place just like it's supposed to. It seems to be very well made. I'm very impressed with the craftsmanship. I love the handle. I love the, the leather grip with the stitching. I love the red color. I really love the accents on it. Overall, it looks like a much nicer, higher quality cane than you normally get. Now, where can you find them and how much are they? Well, these canes are being sold on Amazon. The price right now is $69 for the cane, although it recently was on sale. So it looks like sales go on every now and then. What size do they have? This is a 50 inch. They also have a 55 inch and a 60 inch. Now, keep in mind, you might say, oh, that's too tall for me. But keep in mind that with this longer handle, you can actually choke up on it so you can use a longer cane than you normally would be able to. In the description down below, I will have a link to the No Jab Cane website as well as a link to Amazon where you can purchase this. Now for the fun part. Let's talk about how you can get one of these canes for free. Well, the creator of the No Jab Cane, John, was super generous and gave me an extra one to give away to my viewers. This is the big 60 inch, the big dog. <laughs> so if you are interested in winning this free cane, it's super easy. All you have to do is leave a like on this video, leave a comment on this video, and share this video on either Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. After one month, I will pick a winner and send this out to you free of charge. Now remember though that this is a 60 incher. So if you're like 5'4", <laughs> this might be too tall for you. But either way, good luck. Thank you very much for watching guys. Check out the links in the description down below. As I said, Go to the website and the Blind Life Amazon shop for a link to the Amazon page where you can purchase this cane yourself. If you have any questions for me, please let me know in the comments down below. Do my best to help out. If you like the video, be sure to hit the like button. If you'd like to learn more about living this awesome blind life, <laughs> make sure you're subscribed to the channel and have notifications turned on. Good luck on the contest and we will see you in the next one. All right, you made it to the end. To check out my most recent video, click right there. Or maybe a video that was generated specifically for you because you're so awesome right down there. Also, be sure to check out the Blind Life Amazon shop linked down below where you can find the cool VIP t-shirts. Thanks, guys. We'll see you next time.